That's why today, before God and my family, I'm officially announcing Honey. our president. But now we are a nation in decline. We are a failing nation. We need the courage to lead and the strength to win. America's comeback starts right now. Unbelievable support. How to make America great again, that's a very simple, uh, very simple statement. Your latest revelations about your federal investigation. But decline is a choice. Success is attainable and freedom is worth fighting for. Our great American comeback starts by sending Joe Biden back to his basement in Delaware. <laughs> And then 2020 happened, and the coronavirus struck from China. And Mrs. Karen Pence. As I've said many times, on that fateful day, President Trump's words were reckless. They endangered my family and everyone at the Capitol. And I have to tell you, it was not a layup. The question is, do you, not if you want America to be first or not, it's how. It will never happen. That will be the shortest phone conversation I will ever have as president. He decides that he's going to run. Would that preclude any sort of run that you would? Workers, it can be neighbors. Go tell 10 people and ask them if they know where to vote. You'd be shocked that some people don't know and they don't know who to ask. And the people of South Carolina were shocked. To put it in perspective. Say it often enough, it must be true. And the good news is the Democrats have literally bought into that premise that if you just... ...devil was possible. Good things are coming our way. Thank you all very much. Thank you. Governor, Governor right here, right here. One more right, right here. here. The Biden administration has turned its back on the American worker. Basketball court. I just got a, some, a principal that says don't give us a gym. Okay, we we're right. Okay. When she said, we don't want any more brown faces that don't want to be a brown voice. And that's what created this new culture of fear in America. When it then combined with the second religion. I think I'm the best positioned candidate to deliver national unity in either political party. Because I will embrace unapologetically the extremism of the ideas that America was founded on. We may have lost the, the battle, but we are going to win the war. Thank you. <laughs> the economy needs to be the absolute top priority. Every small business owner and every Small town values are at the core of America. And frankly, big cities could use more ideas and more values from small towns right now. 